Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. As you can see, we are on March 2nd. We are sitting here in the fertilizer spreader. I just finished spreading lime on field 41. Um, so we're going to get that marked down. Uh, there we go. All right. So we're going to jump back into it. Today we're going to work on getting all of our lime spread. And then uh, <clears throat> we'll have all of that done. Oh boy. we got quite a water hole here. We might, uh, we might have to seed around that. We're going to lose a little bit of acreage here, but... Yeah, we are not going to be able to go through that guy. That's unfortunate, because we just lost that entire corner there. And we are almost out of lime, so we will have to run down into the co-op yard there and get filled back up. I don't think that we're going to need a full load, though. Because um, we just have that field there, which I see a giant water hole in. And then that field there. Alright. Well, we are empty, so let's go get filled back up. Yeah, that's... that really sucks. But what can you do? It did rain last night, so... Boy, ah, that one is wet. Oh, goodness. Well, I guess we, uh, we just got to deal with it. We don't really have much of a choice. Can't really plant through it, so no sense in uh, getting anything stuck, breaking anything, or mudding anything up, so... Let's get under here. Let's do... Yeah, we'll just do a full load. Screw it. We're probably going to use it, most of it up, and if not, then we'll have a little bit, I guess, for next year. cleaned out and dump it into a bag or something. I do really like how the elevator is all set up for both sides. And I was reading a guy uh, that's actually from the area was talking about that building there. Um, it's actually a pinto bean elevator. Um, so I think 
Smebby is actually considering adding pinto beans to the map. Or something. He talked about it. It's not a for sure or anything like that, but he did uh, mention it that maybe he will. I know eventually after the map is complete, um, I do want to kind of look into adding alfalfa and uh, cornstalk bales into it. Um, just because I like to play with cows usually, so I'd like to add in at least alfalfa for sure. But we'll see. Okay, let's go up here and do that one. And we'll save that really wet one for last. And as soon as we get all of this done, we'll be ooh, we'll be all set to uh, move forward to April and get um, our corn and soybeans put in, and we're one step closer to harvest. We will also have to spray our oats. Um, for weeds whenever we fast forward or move forward I should say I guess only a few more things left to do until it's just sit around and wait for harvest so we will uh Get that stuff knocked out so we can get to when we'll uh, be making some money. Because that is the main focus. Because we need to make some money. We got a lot of debt to pay off, and if we want to make it, we got to get the crop in, get it off, and expand the best that we can. Definitely glad that I went with a full load. Because I think we're going to need some more. If that's the case, we might just grab a half a load or something, do a little at a time. I'd rather not have a whole bunch left in this to have to clean out, but... If that happens, then it happens, I guess. Not much we can do about it.
I do really like the lime textures that uh, Smevy put in this map though. Definitely a lot better than just a solid white. Made it look a lot more like uh, urea in the trailers or spreaders or whatever you were putting it in and on the fields it looked like you were putting urea down at like a thousand pounds an acre or something. Just too much. Can we get it in two? Probably not. Nope, oh, we're leaving a strip. Um, I don't think that we're going to be able to get all of it in the next pass. Maybe. We'll see. Can we get it all? Yes, perfect. I did not want to have to make one more trip for barely anything. All right. So we've got 39 and 60 done. Just have 59 left to go. Let's take a look here. How much uh, lime do we have left? 13%. So that, that actually used quite a bit. So this field is split in two. We're going to start on this smaller piece here first. We'll see how far we can get with uh, the fertilizer or the lime that we have left. decide in whether or not we uh, or help decide in how much more that we should get because I don't want to get too terribly much whoa okay that thing wants to turn quick as can be apparently. Alright, that's all she wrote. Alright, yeah I think we'll we'll try half a load for now, see how far that gets us. Because we can always run back and get more. I just, uh, I don't want to leave it full. 
case we would need to use this to put some solid fertilizer down or something. And because if we leave lime in this for a year, uh, when we come back to use this spreader again next year, it'll be a nightmare. Because we will have clumped up lime, plugged up. Yeah, we don't want to deal with that. So we're just going to leave it uh, empty. Should be enough to get us through, but like I said, we'll see. We'll see how far we get. It helps that we're right here by the co-op as well, so it makes it easier to uh, run back in here and get some uh, fertilizer, so. actually probably could have gotten a full load. Looks like this might go fairly quick. That's alright. It's not hard to get more. We've already used over 10% just on this little piece. get all of this in one go here. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So, the north half of this is done. Now we get to go deal with the uh, wet second half. Or south half, I should say. Not second half, but south half of it. Got two wet holes in here. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Well, like I said, it is what it is. Gotta make do with it. Can't really farm through it, so. This field is going to take some lime.
Boy, we're really losing a lot of ground in this field. With that wet spot there. Couldn't have let us finish the pass. Okay. I don't think we need quite a half a load. We can do a little less than that, but. Let's just do a half a load here. That'll work. Another 600 bucks. We've already spent 60,000 since the start of spring. So, money is going quick. But I think we should have enough seed to get us through um, the rest of planting. So that'll help because seed gets expensive. Um, and I think we'll probably have to buy some more liquid fertilizer. Um, We'll have to see though, because our corn ground is the only thing that's going to need fertilizer now. Uh, soybeans aren't going to need any more fertilizer. So, um, that'll be fine. But our corn ground will definitely need some fertilizer. go. Let's see if we can pick up a little more of this strip here. Maybe not. Well, shoot. There we go. Oh, we got some of it going. Well, we did. Yeah, half a load was plenty. That'll get us through. We are going to have a decent amount left, about a quarter. That's okay, I'd rather spend the time to uh, clean this thing out than not have enough, so. Perfect. So, this guy is done. as are we. So, let's run this back to the farm. We'll get it washed up and then uh, we'll get this unloaded. Get it uh, taken care of. This guy should be alright on fuel for a while yet, so that'll be good.
We've got a little over uh, six hours on it, so. I know it says 0 0.6, but that 0.6 is about equivalent to six hours, so that's kind of the way I read mine. So, let's pull this up by the pressure washer here. Perfect. Alright, let's hit I. Okay. There it is. Alright. We'll shut him off. And then we'll grab the bobcat. Let's pick this toad up. Now the real question of where should we put it? Let's just stick it beside the bin here. That'll work. We should be done with this, so we can close everything up here. Oh. Come on, go through the door. There we go. Alright. Now let's get this all cleaned up. Perfect. All right. Well, um, oh, I forgot to. We did at auction find this spray trailer. Uh, just a little trailer, tank, and a cone. Nothing fancy, nothing special. But uh, we did pick this up. So we don't have to worry about uh, trying to unload the trailer every time. So. We will uh, use this for our chemical. So we do have that now, and we got the international hook hooked up to the planner. Uh, planner has been checked over; it's ready to rock. So that's going to be it today. And uh, now we just sit around and wait until corn and beans are ready to go in the ground. So that'll be it today, folks. Thanks for. Uh, tagging along with me today and uh, we'll catch you all tomorrow.